Welcome to the Windows and Computer Channel, and this is a quick video to talk about um, a privacy um, concern that some people have actually told me that they have with um, what's happening with the photo app in Windows 10. And um, some of you have asked, you know, what, what I think and, and, you know, should I accept or decline? Because So here's the thing, and I got it today. Also, a lot of you are getting this. If you're using the photo app in Windows 10, you might actually have this little uh, pop-up. Welcome back to Photos. We've enabled new settings for the people feature in our app. It's a great way to find and organize your photos and videos using facial recognition technology. By enabling the people setting, you represent that you have all appropriate consents from the people in your photos and videos. So, of course, that is uh, something that is already enforced in many, many different uh, platforms on iPhones, on Android, um, with the Google Photo app. Basically, this is a, um, even if you're on Facebook, Facebook actually applies this. It's a face recognition technology, basically. So, the good and the bad. Here's the thing. Of course, the photo app syncs your pictures to the cloud. That means that if you enable this setting, face recognition will now know who is who within your pictures. And who is who is going to be, of course, all sent to the cloud so that everything can be synced. The idea behind this is, of course, to make things f easier for you. If you're fi you know, trying to find pictures of a friend, well, now you can actually just type that friend's name and those pictures that have face recognition with your friend on it will all show up. It's actually a great feature to find pictures if you you know if you're like me, I take pictures in uh, pretty much enormous quantity with my phone. So yeah, there's probably thousands, thousands and thousands of picture in my photo app now and that are synchronized to the cloud. That makes it easier if I want to find a specific friend and I personally will enable and accept this setting for that reason. Now the privacy concern that you might have and a lot of you have voiced it is yeah but you know how do I know that this isn't used in a bad way and you know once again we can't we gotta trust I mean uh, the only way that we can use this and think about is it a good thing or not is really in having trust with this setting, with this uh, face recognition in the uh, picture app. So when you are actually uh, using the app, you'll be, uh, of course, asked if you to accept or to decline. And this will be up to you to decide, do I want to or not have face recognition in my pictures? It also brings another um, legal issue, and this is one that they are talking about here also, is that uh, due to certain ways of doing things sometimes um, of course your friends names will be tagged up to their picture meaning that in cross-platform sync there could be kind of a little controversy because maybe your friends don't want to be tagged automatically in a picture uh, it's a little bit like on Facebook you know on Facebook not everybody wants to be tagged in a picture a lot of people want just to, you know, if they show up in a picture, just to stay anonymous if you want. Uh, so that also engages in another legal side of things, and it's the fact that your friend's face might actually be tagged with their names. And, um, of course, that means to be on the safe side, you might want to uh, ask for their consent say well do you mind if I tag you with your name on my pictures so that you know it's easy to recognize or not because that's the other thing that is happening in here so anyways you can accept or decline if you decline well that feature won't be enabled so you know your pictures are gonna stay pretty much anonymous if you accept that means you will be able to tag everything and it will recognize everybody in the pictures uh, when you start tagging the names. So it's up to you to uh, accept or decline. Uh, and of course everybody, a lot of you out there have been saying, well what are you going to do? 
And um, personally, I will accept because I find that it's a, a neat way, an easy way to find things. But I totally understand why some people might not be ready for this. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.